In this video, I'll show you how to create PowerPoint using Gamma AI in minutes. Whether you are teaching science, technology, literature, maths, or any other subject, this is a tool for you. You can use Gamma to create presentation notes, display instructions, and your visuals. Simply create an account on Gamma AI, click sign up for free, sign up using Google account, and create a workspace. For discussion purposes today, I'll be using notes from ChatGPT. The topic for discussion today is impact of climate change on coastal communities. So I have copied that. Now back to the tool. There are three methods that I can use. The first one, I can create a PowerPoint using my own notes and outline on existing content. Then I can create a PowerPoint using a one line prompt in few seconds. Or oh, I can upload a doc or presentation and I will enhance that for me. For discussion purposes, we are using the first one. So if I click on that, click over here, paste my notes, click on presentation, click on continue. Now this tool will create a content for my presentation. Here you go. So text content, the first thing. So I, I can use this just to create, I can create a PowerPoint using that, or contents will make it short, preserve will keep it original. Amount of text per, per card, brief will keep it quite short, medium would be quite summarized, detail will be quite lengthy. Now audience, for, for this purpose, my audience would be high school or college students studying environmental science or related fields, tone, it's quite educational, contains information, and it's quite objective. Now, languages, I can choose from multiple languages that, that are here. Images, I can use or any of the images that are AI generated, or I can opt for my own. Format, I can use all these formats that are given here. Now on this side, your free version will have access to eight cards. Cards in Gamma AI are slides. So you can opt for eight cards, click on continue. Now that will take you to another page where you can choose your theme. So these are the themes for your presentation. If you're not happy with these, you can reshuffle them. Otherwise you can choose more, any of the features over here. So you have picked on that, click on generating PowerPoint. Now your PowerPoint is getting ready, right? So that's your PowerPoint presentation. All right, so the key topics have been highlighted. So there you go. Some questions. The main issue has been discussed as well. Facts and figures have been included. That's your case study. And now the impact of climate change. And how can you manage the impacts and, a con and conclusion as well. So if I had to make this PowerPoint on my own, I'll have to come up with all these layout that's that's out here, all these features I have to do it myself. But the fact that this tool has made things quite easy for me. On this side over here, it's the thumbnail side here for me to navigate through the slides. Now, if I'm happy with that, I can go over here and present, or I can create a presentation, share a link with somebody else who can view this presentation. Now, these images can be changed as well. So if I click over here, I can change the background. I can change the card width. I can play around with this as well. And then I can change the alignment as well. If I'm not happy with the alignment, I can change that as well. The color of the color scheme as well. I can play around with the colors as well. So now images, if I'm not happy with the images, I can use other tools as well. So while I'm here, I'll show you two, two more tools that you can use. So Ask Aligner is another tool that you can use to create images. So you can generate images over here, or you can create a PowerPoint using Google Slides. So, so you can use that as well. Or if you need another tool, the other tool that you can use would be Gravity Right, which will help you, which is which will help you to create images as well. And you can choose any of these features from here. You want to make it realistic. 
or a 3D design. So you can have your images in these formats as well. So simply choose any of the options from here, download the image, and then you can upload that on Gamma AI as well. Now, so what we have done today is we have created a PowerPoint within minutes. So this could be a quite a good tool for you to actually share notes and and revision remedial work with your kids as well, uh, with your students as well. Now, the next thing that you can, the last thing for today would be summary summary of the four tools that we have gone through. I've used uh, ChatGPT to, to create notes on it, and then we used GMAI to create the PowerPoint, and then we also used Elena as well, and then Image Generator as well. So. Gravity, right? So these were the tools that we used. Uh, if you found this video useful, comment on how you will use it in your class.